take no loss. Yeah, I don't even know what it costs. Yeah, I hit the ground and it go off. Yeah, hit the ground and it go off. Yeah, yeah, run it, run it. Oh, I really feel it's my time. Think it's my year. Yeah, yeah, I really feel it's my time. Think it's my year. Yeah, yeah, I really feel it's my time. Think it's my year. Yeah, yeah, I really feel it's my time. Think it's my. So this is my journal from 1992. At the time, I was in Okinawa, Japan as a U.S. Marine, and I was 22 years old when I wrote in this journal, all this journal stuff. And it's amazing because my daughter, my 20-year-old daughter now, is now starting to journal. And I... Um, thought I had it and I put it away in my closet and I, I dug it up and I found it and uh, we kind of read and then later read the whole thing but we read a, a good portion of it but the bottom line is this is that I'm 54 years old now and I can't express enough how important it is to write down what you want to happen in your life. Write it down. This literally is a miracle. It is insane. I mean, um, I have in here, I wrote down um, one of my goals right here. And uh, one of my goals is to have a beautiful wife by June, by December 12th, 1996, right? Now, I was 22, it was 1992, and I wrote to have a beautiful wife by December 12th, 1996, right? Four years later. Now, amazingly enough, I got married November 16th, 1996, right? And I said, bye, December 12th, 1996. Now, I wrote this when I was 22. Now, my wife that I've been married now for 28 years, the love of my life, I married November 16th, 1996. Um, literally, almost to the T, and I didn't even know her. I was on an island in Japan, Okinawa, Japan, as a US Marine. I haven't even met her yet. And I wrote this down in the book, and it came to fruition. That's just one thing. Um, another thing I wrote in the book is that I, at 22, would buy apartment complexes and rent them out. I own 760 apartment complexes today, right? <laughs> just amazing. I also wrote in this book, and I, I read the book, Psycho Cybernetics, Think and Grow Rich, Power of Positive Thinking, why I was in Japan, in Okinawa, um, and I wrote in here that I would uh, buy real estate, right? Distress real estate and flip it for a fee or fix it up and sell it. And it's exactly what I do today. Flip houses, wholesale houses. I fix and flip houses, uh, own apartment complex. I even talk about buying land in the outskirts and, and uh, entitling it and selling it um, to potential builders for a fee or for whatever. Um, I mean, some of the things in here are absolutely insane on how accurate they are. I, I, I even said I would own a Porsche and a Rolex, right? And today I have a Porsche and obviously a Rolex. So, um, I mean, this, is the power of writing something down. Writing your goals down every day, every night. Reading your goals every day, every night. Now, I didn't read them every day, every night. I literally wrote them down this down in 1992, early 1993, and I put it away and I literally forgot about it. But because I wrote it down every single day, it's amazing that my life literally turned into this book exactly what I wrote from my, from it's, I mean, I, I was literally shocked. My daughter was completely shocked. You know what she did? She started writing in her journal. So, you know, I just hope it inspires you and maybe you been kind of down on life and you're kind of, you know, you're, 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 you're you know, you got doubt and you got fear and you got, you know, this world and stuff going on. You're going, what can I do? 
Write down what you want. Even if you don't know how it's gonna happen, you don't know where it's gonna come from, you don't know the situation, you don't know, you know, uh, you don't you don't have all the answers you might not know you know how it's gonna i didn't know how i was gonna buy apartment complex when i was 22 on an island in japan i was a marine i didn't know i, was, I could find distressed properties and fix it up and sell them or just sell them for a fee i didn't know about that but i read an article in a success magazine that said this is something that was done i was like you know what that sounds really cool i think i want to do that and i wrote it down it's something i wanted to do you know so, so if you're struggling right now, or if you're, you know, you don't know about your future or your vision or what you want to create, or you're kind of going through this, um, lull or something that you're just kind of, it's just, you don't feel like you're getting any, any, any better, any forward. You're not having a forward motion or whatever, write it down, write what you want to have in your life. Think about positive things. Think about your future. Visualize yourself in the future of what you want. And I'm going to tell you, you'll be amazed because, you know, yes, I'm 54 years old. I'm old now, <laughs> you know, um, but you might be in your 20s, might be in your 30s, 40s, whatever. Even if you're in your 50s, 60s, whatever. The bottom line is right down. I'm still writing down today the things I want to have in the future right? Write them down. It is important. It is a success principle. And this is proof that it will work for you. Um, and, and it was, it was pretty shocking. So I just thought I'd share this with you guys. Um, hope you have a blessed day. Um, go write something down, something that you want, get incited, get inspired about it. And, uh, I'll see you in the future. God bless. Can't take no loss, yeah. I don't even know what it costs, yeah. I hit the ground and it go off, yeah. Hit the ground and it go off, yeah, yeah. Run it, run it, oh. I really feel it's my time, think it's my year, yeah, yeah. I really feel it's my time, think it's my year, yeah, yeah. I really feel it's my time, think it's my year.